This video, I'm going to show you the best defense in college football 25. We talked a little bit about this yesterday. I dropped a full ebook on this, and we've since updated it as well. Uh, it's a 335 penny. This is in the 335 tight defensive playbook. It is by far and away the best defense in the game. It's the best blitz in the game. It's the best send five in the game. It's the best send three in the game. It's the best send four in the game. It's the best run defense. It has the best coverage adjustments. This defense is really, really, really good. If you want to get my full defensive ebook on this, that is going to be in our school.com community. Again, like I said, I updated it for you guys with new pressure new concepts, new coverages, really, really good defense. And uh, we're just going to show you this Saw Blitz 3. Uh, you can do it out of Pinch Blitz 0 or Saw Blitz 3. Those are the two best. What I would really recommend is your shell. Make that a Cover 0 shell. If you want to put Auto Flip on or off, it's really up to you. But the Cover 0 shell is really the key. All right, so then all we're going to do to set the splits up is we are simply going to spread our defensive line. We're going to uh, spread our linebackers and then you can either crash to one side or you can crash out so here we're going to crash to the right and you see whichever side you crash to so like let's say for example you're watching this you're like i only wanted to send one side you can just send it off of the running back side and you can see here so i'm going to crash to the left and i'm going to actually spy and contain on the back side here and you're going to see this is still going to hum off the edge so that's a four-man blitz that is really really effective and this, the other reason why this defense is so good is because mobile quarterbacks are going to be a problem in college football 25. So by having this method, you're going to be able to, you know, basically put a stop to the mobile quarterbacks. Every now and then, this blitz will randomly get picked up when you do the spread version. Um, the blitz, the, the version I showed you the other day was a um, a shift uh, a shift like this where you're shifting to the side. This is going to pretty much guarantee it's going to come off that left side every single time. So that's just some things that you you know might want to know. And then. If you want it to come off the right side, I find that you want to blitz it off of like the open side. But if you want it to come off the right side, just basically crash right. And normally it will, but because the running backs on that side, it can be a little bit more problematic, a little bit more challenging. Uh, but in general, this blitz is super good. There's a lot of methods, a lot of ways in which you can run the splits uh, with your user just kind of trying to basically get down here and mess with the center. It's a super simple send five, but it's really effective. And we show you how to adjust out of this. Now, if I was playing bunch or something, one of my favorite adjustments is you actually have the big nickel over G type adjustments here. So what you can do here is you can send your you can set your defense up like so, and then you can actually use this slot corner as kind of like a man-to-man -man defender on whoever you're wanting him to slow down. And then obviously you have your blitz behind it, a good user. You don't really have to worry about the running back. They're going to have to block the running back, block the tight end. They're going to have to do pass protection uh, to stop this blitz. But in general, guys, this is, in my opinion, probably the best blitz in the game. Um, I actually don't think it's even close because you see just how fast it comes in. Like, it's super good. And then also you're able to uh, just get a lot of pressure. And then you can, if you want to, you can play coverage with this defense. So you could do something like this. And then let's say you want to send it off that right side. You know, you certainly can try. Sometimes this right side's a little weird with the cluster. Um, let's see if we can get it here. Yep, we got that B gap, super good. And every now and then you'll get that B gap. It doesn't always come off the edge. It sometimes comes from the B gap. Matt or uh, college football. And Madden is like this too, but college football is definitely like this this year. It's just a, it's a little bit glitchy, right? So there's, there's little, like sometimes it comes from the edge. Sometimes it comes from the B gap. It depends on the formation. It depends on the alignment. It depends on the even the user hover. All those things are factors here. But I love this defense. I think this is one of my. Uh, best day one defenses we've dropped and if you guys have not already joined the school community i'd really encourage you to it's only 10 bucks get you access to everything we have over there all of the and the cool part is it updates we've literally probably dropped over 20 videos at least maybe 30 uh within the first 24 hours of college football 25 being live and we already broke the game so if you want to check that out we also show one play touchdowns against every coverage in the game so thanks for watching the video hope you enjoyed it if you want to sign up for the school.com community page link's gonna be down in the description below